All right, in today's video, we're just going to do a general overview of the wallet. So once we synchronize the blockchain, we'll see that we're not mining. It's very easy to mine. You simply turn it on. And it goes to the pickaxe. At the very beginning, it calculates your hash rate. We can see that I have one gigabyte of RAM with eight mining threads there's my hash. Your hash will increase and then stabilize. Alright so let's get an address. Simply label the address and request there we go. Copy the address like this or highlight it. Simply copy. Alright I'll be back as soon as I send the nuts. Okay, as we can see, the transaction is here. It's unconfirmed, and it resides in the pending balance until it's confirmed. As soon as it's confirmed, I'll be back. All right, we've got our confirmation here. So let's go ahead and make a deposit. All right, at this point, it's probably a good time to turn on your coin control to do such. Simply enable it, and here we have it. Okay, uh, so you go into coin control. <clears throat> Something in coin control that uh, you can tell is, is that you can tell your interest off of the table here. Uh, so we go ahead and we select the uh, input that we'd like to use. And we simply copy. Let's copy our complete balance. Simply copy it. Uh, we'll see insufficient funds. So simply subtract the fee. That's because there's a fee that needs to be taken out. All right, we don't have an address. So we simply come over, send it right back to ourselves and deposit. You can send it to whoever you'd like. This one we're going to send back to ourselves. 12 months. So we hit, there we go. And it tells you a uh, confirmation pop up. Simply tells you how much it'll be worth and the approximate uh, time frame. So for this video, we'll simply just enter two blocks. So here we go. We'll confirm it. And then we confirm that, yes, we do want the fee taken. There we go. All right. So here we have our deposit. We have an immature balance. We'll be back as soon as it becomes mature. OK, as we can see, it is now matured. <clears throat> it's moved from an immature balance to an available balance. The thing to note here is, is that it's no longer producing any interest. So to do such, we'll have to move it. Easiest way to do that is just send it to ourself. So simply go back into coin control, select this, shows the interest. All right, now to get our address again, Simply copy our address here, send it back to ourself. Uh, for the amount, we'll just send the whole thing. Insufficient funds, we take the fee out and we send it back to ourself. And there we go. It's now accumulating interest for 30 days. And then you'll have to move it again. Thanks for watching.